three ghosts trapped on video. Hello folks all over the world, welcome back to the 14th episode of Top 3 Ghosts Trapped on Video. Our search and selection of the most interesting videos continues incessantly. Every Saturday a new episode comes out, so if you are new and you like this content subscribe and click on the bell to stay updated. Said that, let's go straight to the third position. The Cyclist's Ghost Rides Harm Each year, about 2% of motor vehicle crash deaths are bicyclists. Although child bicyclist deaths have declined over the years, deaths among bicyclists age 20 and older have tripled since 1975. And this also explains why more and more crosses and flowers are seen at the roadside. The video we are going to see was published on TikTok by the user Durban Paranormal on the day of the death, November 2, 2021. We do not know the exact location, the video was taken by a security camera in a residential center. In the first few seconds of the video, we saw the translucent figure of what appears to be a cyclist racing at high speed in the fast lane for bicycles, but in the opposite direction to the road. It is difficult to understand what it really is, you can see some wheels, and the features of a slanted shadow on what appears to be the frame of a bicycle, before the light of the headlights of the car arrives. It could be a camera glitch on the whole cyclist figure from start to finish, although it is a bit strange because the dark figure goes slightly slower than the other cars, so it wouldn't be a speed factor. Even the classic pixelated contrasts with the other objects are not seen during the passage of the figure. If you have any ideas about it, please write your opinion on the comments below. Dark Entity from Another Time Scale In second position, he bring a video that is causing the paranormal community to discuss a lot. We are in the Lumberton, North Carolina, USA area. On October 11, 2020, Facebook user Sandra Fulton Hamilton John posted a video on his page that was sent to her by a deaf friend named Jack while he was talking on video chat. Let's see it together. While Jack speaks in sign language in the video call, behind him through the open door, a decidedly disturbing dark shadow can be seen speeding through the hall. At the end of the video, instead you can see the face of a probable family member of Jack who looks out at the same door, and you can see how the image is more natural and human. While it may sound absurd, numerous comments on the video reported similar experiences with testimonials. Even the context, where there is a disabled adult who does not seem to have intentions related to appearing on social networks, further confirms the veracity of this testimony. Some users argue that these entities move on laws of physics and time different from our dimension, and this would explain the unnatural speed and passage of matter. The Ghost of the Little Girl in the Phantom In first position this week we have a video shot in an area renowned for the number of deaths, and since the 1980s it has been the scene of Mexican drug cartels, where groups of drug traffickers divided territories for power and money, spreading numerous innocent victims. This area is known all over the world thanks to the Narcos TV series. We are in fact inside a cemetery in Culiacan, Sinaloa, Mexico. The video was broadcast live on Facebook and on the Hell Payaso de la Toledo YouTube channel on March 15, 2021. The video begins with Hell Payaso, which summarizes the previous time he had gone to this cemetery with his group, where they had always streamed live the extraordinary figure of a little girl dressed in white, passing among the tombs of the Fantian. In this exploration for the second time, they will try to capture this entity apparently dead in a tragic situation. Pues, con mucho miedo, payasos, de verdad, porque la pudimos captar muy, muy clarito, demasiado claro. From the very first minutes of the exploration, the group manages to film a strange figure in the distance crossing the road. It is not clear whether it is the figure of the little girl or another humanoid figure. The distance does not allow a clear image. Y, pues bueno. Vamos a ver si le encontramos nuevamente para saber qué podemos captar. 
Hel Payaso with the group moves to the place where they met the child, describing the incredible situation, and they try to call the entity asking her to manifest. Niña? ¿Estás aquí todavía? Danos una señal. Uy. Uy. ¿Escuchaste? Mamá. ¿Se escuchó mamá, compa? Ramon or also called Hell Payaso starts a spirit box session in the exact point where the girl was seen, to ask her age and name and while they were wandering around the nearby graves, the voice of the child is clearly heard, listen. Otra vez, mamá. Escuchó mamá. ¿En dónde está, niña? ¡Uy! While looking for the baby, Ramon explains that it would be necessary to return to the place with a fixed camera to understand what it really is, and why this very sad voice is heard. Estar aquí. Para ver que realmente si es una niña o que sea. O que sea. An interesting investigation this of the cemetery of Sinaloa, we will see Hel Payaso and his group in the next episodes. It is inevitable thinking to the end of the second season of the TV series Narcos Mexico, of the four-year-old girl Natalie who, together with her five-year-old brother Jesus, were thrown by the Narcos from a bridge, as revenge for a showdown. That's all for today, we'll meet next week with a new episode, if you have any reports you can leave them at the email eradeproductions at gmail.com, follow us on our social networks and subscribe to the channel to not miss the news of the next few days. Thanks for watching, good night.